Ni Hao, thanks to Big Wall at a tree park in Shanghai, China, where exercise is a part of everyday life. It might be hard to imagine that in Shanghai, considered China's largest city with a population of over 23 million residents and high-rise residential districts overflowing with people, that there are any green spaces available. But visitors to this bustling cosmopolitan city might be surprised to know that Shanghai has a rich heritage of cultural sites, parks, and gardens throughout the city. Many of these parks, such as the tree park we are visiting today, have been around for decades and serve as a daily gathering spot for Shanghainese people to engage in a variety of exercises, such as Tai Chi, or for vigorous stretching, jogging and walking, or for simply enjoying the sounds of nature and the serenity away from the traffic and noise. The Shanghai Tree Park offers visitors a respite from the stresses of daily living. Over 40% of Shanghai's older population, those residents between the ages of 51 and 60, exercise on a regular basis. Another surprise that visitors to Shanghai parks might find while listening to the lilting tunes of the songbirds is that the birds are not nesting in the parks on their own, but rather these birds have been placed in the trees in cages. This is due to the fact that many birds were destroyed during the avian flu outbreak in China several years ago and are just beginning to repopulate naturally. The placement of songbirds in parks is one method the Shanghai government is using to repopulate the city with flocks of birds. Early in the morning or late in the day, a visit to one of Shanghai's beautiful parks will find many people engaged in activities while listening to the sounds of Tai Chi music and strategically placed songbirds. Baxter Big Wall leaving you with these Chinese words of wisdom. Make happy those who are near and those who are far will come. Until next time.